And I think the Yetis will be smart to keep the ball on the ground in the first half as they're going into the into this breeze. We're underway. Daryl Fordyce with the kickoff and the ball uh, straight towards the captain here, Nick Ledgerwood, in the right back spot. Yep. Ring in space, just off the attackers. Smart will chip it in again, and Zayed will think that he should have scored there with a very good chance. And nicely worked play by Indy. Zayed from virtually point blank range. The ball did bounce, but uh, it was only Farago in front of him. Uh, for Eamon Zayed, a player who can score like he can, that's got that's got at least got to at least hit the keeper. I know, I know he sees the keeper coming at him, and I think. Legend makes one over the top. Niassi storms onto it. Saving Niassi. It's a beauty. Great finish. Lovely strike. A perfect pass from Leisurewood. And what a breakaway goal that is. Niassi gets Edmonton on the board. They're up 1 0. You see the A's trying to go over the top earlier in this game, and this time Ledgerwood goes over the top. And in this case, the wind does the Eddies exactly the favor you hoped that they, it would do. It holds the ball up. And Niassi, what a great first touch in stride. And then he picks the corner. Fordyce picks out Niassi again. He's around the back one more time. If he gets there ahead of Bush, there's a chance here for the Eddies. Fordyce just can't send it towards goal, but Niassi really. In a good run of stations there, and it's uh, Vukovic in the end that gets, or sorry, it's Falvi who gets the sliding challenge to stop Fordyce from coming over. Bush comes over to get this ball. You can see Fordyce plays it. Niassi again getting behind the defenders. Bush comes out, but he can't control it, and then he just sort of knocks it in no man's land. Over the top, Aniobi's away here. He's in behind Falvi this time. And around him again, here's the cut back into the box, a real chance in there, it's a penalty. Fisk is brought down, it's a penalty kick, referee was on the spot, blew the whistle instantly. That's an easy one for him to make. Yeah, it was a great cut back from Amiobi. It starts though, what does that start with? Tyson Farago bombing the ball down the pitch. Again, Falvi doesn't judge it right, Amiobi gets behind, Amiobi slides the ball to Fisk, and now we'll see Dustin Correa is going to walk to the spot here and try to make it 2-0. It's Dustin Korea versus John Bush for a chance to make it 2-0 here to FC Edmonton. Oh, and he's chipped it into the left-hand corner. We might have just spotted Bush diving there because it was a cute little chip. He didn't really go for any power. And he's a penalty expert, and we've seen this approach before. And he's made it 2-0. Yeah, it's a, it's a cheeky penalty. We see this happen sometimes, and it's just a, a little chip down the middle. So curled this to the far post, and it's going to bounce off Amiobi and go into touch, but it's going to be too late for Indy. It's all over, and FC Edmonton have taken three points. A very fine home win, good value for the 2-0 victory. Niassi putting them in the lead with a terrific goal. And then Dustin Career, a very cute chip penalty kick.